for me, it has been for quite a while, the new kind of terrorism that afflicts the world. It's no longer these so-called non-state actors. These guys are organized. They have an army, they have a self-professed state, and they have a capacity to harm us gravely. Everybody seems to have forgotten 9-11 in Boston, but Paris should have reminded us of what's at stake. So for me, the threat in the world today that gets the priority, and I mean it gets the priority of the President of the United States, I don't care whether he's a Republican or a Democrat, is the combination of this new kind of terrorism, these civil wars, ethnic, religious, zealous civil wars which drive this terrorism, and the fact that these guys desperately want materials of weapons of mass destruction. A cup this size of radioactive material aboard those planes on 9-11 would have made lower Manhattan inhabitable even today.